There's always the possibility that that phone will ring and it will be the, the, the very rare painting, the very rare work of art, the very, very rare something that I've been waiting for. I know it will happen eventually and uh, who knows, today could be the day. It's what gets me out of bed, it's what motivates me to, uh, to just sit by the phone, to reach out to as many people as I can and, and hope that the treasure's waiting. My name is Richard Cervantes, I'm Director of Asian Art at Heritage Auctions. I started off my career at one of the oldest auction houses in the country as an art handler, but I learned a lot on the way and that really led me on my path to, uh, to being an auction specialist. What I find very interesting as a specialist is trying to track down a history of any given artwork. To take for example the, the charger to my left, it's by the most important artist of the Meiji period who worked in this uh, kind of satsuma ware. Roughly five times larger than most works of art that would even be considered large by this artist. So what does that tell me? I know this is an artist who displayed at uh, world expositions within his lifetime. Uh, remember, this is the period when Japan was opening up to the rest of the world, so I suspect this piece was made for display at, who knows, 1893 Chicago, 1900 Paris Exposition. Um, these are things that really keep me going, and of course I have many phone calls to make, many clients to meet, but really the joy for me is in trying to discover that hidden history that's been lost over the years of ownership. Speaking very frankly, there's a finite supply, naturally, of good Chinese antiques in this country. Uh, they're becoming harder and harder to find, and uh, I thought that by coming to Heritage Auctions, this company, because of its size, because of its reach, because of its um, efficiency, sophistication, it would allow me a greater opportunity to meet new clients and find new property, and uh, it's paid off. I made the right decision. Discovery really is what, is what brings me a great amount of pleasure. So when I discover something very rare, very unique, I get the biggest thrill, I think, out of finding that and presenting it to the market. Uh, I found one time, uh, in a private home, a large Chinese cloisonné sensor from the 17th century. I had never seen one like it, and uh, I have still not seen another one like it. Uh, the, the, our clients were perplexed. They were enchanted, as I was, and it sold for a tremendous amount of money. But I really feel like I discovered something that, uh, that really added to the scholarship. It was something that had not been documented before. I get an extra added uh, satisfaction, let's say, from seeing the property repatriated to China, where, uh, where it comes from, and in some cases hasn't been since, uh, well, for two, three hundred years. There's a great amount of pleasure I get from it. These artifacts were taken away from the country. And little by little, they're being discovered and repatriated, as I said. Heritage is very much the people's auction house, which I think resonates with many clients and even, even some very, very high-end collectors. The customer service here is, I think, second to none. Uh, there, there's always help available, but Heritage spreads a very wide net. We have clients all over the world, certainly all over every corner of the United States. We, we do take in so many consignments of worthwhile property from all over the country. Um, we have a tremendous network of specialists, all of whom have great experience. Uh, there's a tremendous amount of goodwill between the company and our, and our clients, our consigners. And, uh, and I think we make bidding very, very friendly, very easy, and uh, ultimately very rewarding for the consigners and the buyers. Thank you.